WWE has often presented us with edgy, questionable, female-centric storylines in the past, and we wondered how it didn't land the company in troubled waters. I'm Jeremy, and here are five female storylines that might get WWE canceled. Number five, Santino Morella wins Miss WrestleMania. Back in 2009, WWE hosted a Miss WrestleMania contest at the 25th anniversary of WrestleMania. Santino Morella wanted to be in the women's battle royal match so bad that he dressed himself in women's clothes and pretended to be his own sister, Santina Morella. Did not take a genius to figure out what was going on. Santino, or rather Santina, won the Miss WrestleMania title, and in the weeks that followed, WWE presented a story of whether Santino and Santina were the same person. While Santino Morella is no doubt a great entertainer, him dressing up as a woman and winning a women's only tournament was a disservice to the female talent. Thankfully, a lot has changed since then, as female superstars headline a ton of shows, and WWE won't get away scot-free with a man dressing up as a woman to win a woman's tournament. Number four, Trish barks like a dog. Back in 2001, Vince McMahon forced Trish Stratus to strip down to her undergarments in the middle of a ring and bark like a dog. Why you ask? Well, during that time, Vince was facing marital difficulties with his wife, Linda McMahon, as part of a storyline. Mr. McMahon then filed for a divorce, which led to Linda having a breakdown. The WWE Universe then witnessed the now former chairman of WWE begin a romantic angle with Trish Stratus. Vince and Trish even made out in front of a wheelchair-bound Linda McMahon. After some time, Vince grew tired of playing with his toy, and then one fine night, he ordered Stratus to perform the humiliating act. A man ordering his female employee to strip down and bark like a dog is unacceptable, and WWE has to consider themselves lucky that this did not lead them to getting canceled immediately. Number three, Piggy James. Even though Mickey James is a six-time WWE Women's Champion, she had her fair share of weird storylines during her tenure with the company. One controversial storyline that sticks out like a sore thumb is the infamous Piggy James angle. Back in 2010, Mickey was involved in a feud with the duo Michelle McCool and Layla. One night, Lay Cool presented the WWE Universe with the segment as Layla came to the ring dressed as Piggy James, and they compared Mickey's body shape to that of a pig. Not only was that demeaning, but one glaring issue with the story was James wasn't even overweight. The angle led to a title reign for Mickey, but the inconsiderate storyline hurt the sentiments of the hardcore country girl. With body shaming being a serious issue these days, such storylines could definitely have led to WWE getting canceled. Number two, Triple H and Katie Vick. One of the most disturbing segments in WWE history took place in 2002. At the time, World Heavyweight Champion Triple H was feuding with Intercontinental Champion Kane. This later led to a title unification match between the two that took place at No Mercy. Leading up to that, we saw Triple H conjure up a fake story about Kane's past. The Cerebral Assassin claimed that Kane once had a one-sided relationship with a woman named Katie Vick. He further insinuated that Vick was killed in a car accident. Kane had sex with her dead body. As if the subject of necrophilia wasn't bad enough, Triple H then showed footage where he donned Kane's mask and reenacted the scene to a shocked WWE Universe. The storyline was not popular with the fans back then for obvious reasons, and WWE should be glad they got away with it at the time. Number one, Mae Young and Mark Henry's child. As head scratch as it sounds in the late 90s, sexual chocolate Mark Henry got involved in a romantic angle with Mae Young. If you thought that the story of a 20-something Henry romancing a woman in her 80s was controversial enough, wait till you find out what ensued later on. After allegedly spending a few nights together, Mae announced to the WWE Universe that she was pregnant with Henry's child. One night, Viscera, who was at the time feuding with Henry, landed a splash on the pregnant Mae Young. The veteran superstar then went into labor and was seen backstage giving birth to a single hand. Yes, a human hand. While WWE has paid tribute to the late Mae Young by hosting the Mae Young Classic, this uncomfortable storyline will forever leave a bad taste in the mouths of those who remember it. And that's our video for today. If you enjoyed it, like the video, drop a comment, and share it with your friends. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel, Russell Binge by Sportskeeda. 